themselves. Are you surprised that there may be as many believers in China today as there are in the United States of America? No, I think in actual count, if you looked at the Chinese church, which is somewhere between 80 and 100 million, depending on the estimates, yeah. some people say 120, uh, there probably are more true Christians in China than there are in the United States. And I'm not surprised at all, because they've had to pay a price for their faith. Yeah. Well, that's, that's a, it's an irony, isn't it? That the, the, more, the more pressure on the, on the community of faith, the, the faith thrives. It's been the case for 2,000 years. Yeah. It's not any different today. And what we think about as grace becomes often cheap grace, yeah. as Bonhoeffer put it again, to quote yeah. him. It has to be costly grace. It has to cost you everything yeah. or you're not going to respect. Yeah. If you get something for free, yeah. do you really treat it well? Yeah. No. Yeah. You can throw it away. But if you have to give your life for something, you, you fight to the end for it. What has ministry to the prisoner done to you personally? Well, it's totally transformed me because I've been surrounded by the most powerless people in the world. I also have an autistic child in my family, a grandson whom I love dearly, who mm. would be eliminated by mm. the eugenicists, mm. which are back in our midst and right. active and talking loudly. Yeah. Uh, weeding out the defectives, uh, the curse that comes upon us when we stop respecting life in every stage. But to be among the prisoners, I, I've kind of absorbed their view of life. You see life differently from the other side of society. From the bottom of society looking up when I was in prison, you see something very different than you do when you're in the top side of society looking down. And you never quite forget it. You'll never get over the experience of losing your son. And tragic though it is, God will use that in powerful ways with you. I, you know, you asked me about power corrupting, absolutely. Power corrupted me, absolutely, in the White House, and could again today with ease. I recognize that. The only thing that keeps me from it today is that I spend so much time with people who are powerless and disenfranchised that I, I can't shake their point of view. Uh, last last uh, question. Um, tell me about your family. In, in, in your book, uh, The Faith, you wrote about both your son, one of your sons, and your daughter having cancer at the same time, yeah. autistic grandchild. How are your family doing? Our family is doing great, thank you. Yeah. I mean, every family's got problems. Yeah. But uh, my daughter has really blossomed. Uh, she's written a book of her own, Dancing with Max, about her autistic son. That's a wonderful book. She's been mm. out preaching with me. I mm. had a great experience going to uh, uh, Willow Creek and doing all three services with mm. my daughter. I did the eight minute setup for her, and <laughs> she did the talk, and she was a better speaker than I am with a great message, yeah. a great response from the crowd. So that's very satisfying. Yeah. My wife has had major surgery this year, come through it flying colors. Both of my boys now are in great health and doing well and building wonderful families. Got a rebellious granddaughter. <laughs> Everybody does that. That means she's got a brain. Yeah, right. How, how are you doing? I'm doing great. Uh, better than I deserve. You're turning 80 this year. I will. I'll turn 80 this uh, fall and I uh, don't like to think about it. October? I, pardon? October? October. Which day? October 16th. Okay, I'm October 1, so ah. we're, 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 on the same, we're in the same wavelength. Well, it's been a pleasure having you. Thank and, you very uh, much for having you've, me. You've uh, got a very busy life, and it really means a lot to us that you've spent some time with us. I'm happy to do it. This is a great program. I've been on over the years a number of times, as you well know, and yeah. I think it's terrific. I wow. think it's a great outreach, and thank God you're, in, you're staying with it. Well, it's been a pleasure. Thanks very much. Thanks.